getting this barn swallow nest down. It was a really pretty barn swallow nest, um, super strong. But we are going to um, deter them from building here next year because this summer we had triple digit weather and we found out that they can't really, the babies can't survive anything higher than 90 degrees Fahrenheit. So when we had that hot couple of days, I noticed that the barn swallow parents were flying in and out of the garage kind of desperate. And I noticed one of the babies was putting his head up and kind of panting. I thought maybe it was wanting worms or something, but it was a hot day. And I, I thought, you know, for sure that they're too hot. And yeah, we didn't see the barn swallow parents the next day flying around and I didn't see the little guys poking their heads up. So I'm pretty sure they perished in the heat. Um, we even read that if it's too hot, they will throw themselves from the nest. So it's tragic and it's sad and it's all part of farming, but I don't think I'll ever get beyond the sad, tragic part. So I'm gonna give this one more little chisel. We did see an egg that had not hatched that was left in the nest. Um, I don't see any baby carnage, so I don't have to be traumatized by that. They're using a lot of feathers from my chickens to feather their nest, so that's kind of cool. But yeah, next year we're, we're not gonna let them um, do their thing here. It's cooler in the barn. We did have some there, but I guess these guys just wanted to try this out. Uh, so sad, but reality. We'll have some more sections, uh, more information about birds as I get beyond this horrible thing. <laughs> Thank you.